Everybody knows time is money, so I'm gonna give you two minutes of my time so you can make money. So what is the think about what clothes and how can you use the think about what clothes to increase your sales? Listen, the think about what clothes is usually used to handle the objection I need to think about it, which is a very common objection, a very annoying one, but it's used in this case. So let's say you present your product, let's say you're, you finish your sales presentation and your client, John, says he wants to think about it. All you have to do is ask him, John, I completely understand, always agree with him, I understand, what do you need to think about? Is it the product or is it the price? Now, if it's the product, you know how you need, you need to re, you need to summary close them. You need to repitch them. You did a mistake in your presentation, or is something he didn't understand? If it's the price, you then ask, okay, is it the deposit you want to think about, or is it the installments? See, if it's the installments, maybe you can make longer installments or put more into the deposit. Or if it's the deposit, maybe you can break that up into three deposits, right? So, for example, let's say your client says it's the installments, and you can do like a Mr. Echo, like the installments. And he might say something like, yes, I have my kids' school fees to pay for the next three months, and you can say, okay, I understand. What if I under, what if I start the installments after three months? Do you, did you see where I'm getting with this? So you basically keep on asking him where the obstacle is, and then you close that obstacle. That's what we mean by always be closing, by the way. Now, if you want, if you want more ways to close the I want to think about an objection, here are five ways, five best ways to close that objection so you'll never have a problem with this objection again. I'm Paul Democritu, and until next time, keep succeeding.